This is the King Electric Washboard. Um, this was inspired by the spasm bands in New Orleans back in the early 20s and stuff, the uh, street bands you'd see. And for percussion, they'd have a washboard player. They'd get the old washboards that their moms probably used, stole when they were working, and sat there and just scratched. And then I thought, screw it, let's make it electric. And it literally has all the bells and whistles. Um, it's got a nice little car horn. Because it's just the goofiest freaking thing. I've got my uh, bell. Um, I've got my pickup inside underneath an old tuna can, which I actually realize is really cool for bass. Kind of vibes. So I get a little. Then down here we've got your uh, tip jar that you can also throw your uh, picks into. It's just something that you can find all sorts of weird sounds, like uh, actually on the side I've got a piece of sandpaper. I need another little weird kind of little thing and then, a strip of leather, so. There's really not a place on this instrument that you can't find some sort of sound that you can use. I haven't messed around a lot of washboards, so I'm still sort of learning. Um, if you want to check out a really good washboard player, check out Jan. She's in a band called HJ Country and also Kazoo Cats, a couple other things. Great player here in Tallahassee. And I'm going to mess around a little bit more on this. Uh, here we go. See you next time. Have a good one. She hopped right up in my truck. Oh, man in the moon, won't you give me some love? Cause me and my baby going out tonight. We staying out till the morning light. We don't care if we're out late. Cells in day. 